Warriors, and welcome to another exciting edition of Street Combat Systems. Today we're going to do part two, or episode two, of the brutal strikes that can stop any attacker series. So today we're going to do whip to the face, open palm to the throat, and as we draw back, sword hand to the throat. So we're going to go whip to the face, open palm to the throat. As soon as this comes back, we're throwing this one into it. So basically you've got... Now it's gonna feel a little uncomfortable at first and it may take a while for you to learn it, so we'll go slow. So from here, even if your hands are down by your side and you're caught off guard, we're gonna step in, whip, open palm, sword hand to the throat. So again, whip, Grab a bomb, sword hand to the throat. So those two are simultaneously occurring. So you're hitting here, and as I draw back, I throw that to the throat. Now if you don't want to do an open palm to the throat, you can do the whip, open palm, and whip again. Because that first shot, that whip, is the stunner. Right in the nose, eyes are going to water. They're gonna stop, stumble a little bit, okay? And that's when you come in, throw that open palm. So it's whip, open palm, sword to the throat. And you, you gotta practice those so you can rattle it off super quick. That hurts a lot worse than you think. Where I'm here, my hands are down, and I'm looking around, and all of a sudden this dude's in my face. You're throwing that palm, that open, uh, whip or that backhand whip to the face. So again, real simple. Doesn't have to be pretty. Doesn't have to be perfect. It just has to reach the target. That's all you have to do. So again, it's whip, open palm, and as I'm pulling back, and just practice it. You do it slow at first. So you can do it, you can move around the bag, you know, even if I was stepping off to the side, from the side here, I'm going, I can hit the carotid artery over here if he was facing this way. Okay, I can still come here, and then I can continue my attack if I wanted to. Go here, 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 step in. I don't even have to see, I don't even have to be looking. Okay, I can see him out of the corner of my eye. Here he comes. My hands, it's like taking, it's like a backhand with a ping pong paddle. I'm just taking it, whipping it out there. Okay, whip. Now that's a strong move right there, because now I got him. I can, I can just, I can tighten up on him, grab him here, and just start choking. There's nothing he can do. I'm in his space. He can hug me. I can step behind him, brace myself, and just keep squeezing and squeezing and squeezing until he gives up or passes out. And that whip, that whip is, you know, I'm surprised you don't see it. I watch a lot of these self-defense videos, and some of them, and I hate to be like that, are just downright friggin' stupid because that shit's not gonna work. Anybody that's ever been in a street fight, a bar fight, or whatever, you, you, that kind of stuff doesn't work. I mean, here. If I got a guy here, I can whip. Here comes another guy, throw a whip that way, throw a whip this way. I can step in and snap him to the balls, you know, the eye, the temple. If I'm off to the side, to the temple, there, temple there, ear, anywhere. Okay, ribs, okay. You, or you could just keep whipping. That person just didn't know what the frick happened to him. Practice that. And do your drills. On the days when you're getting, before you get ready to do your techniques, just hit. Just do that. For the first few minutes before you 
can do your drills. Get your hands conditioned, get your speed down, get your accuracy down, especially conditioning his hands. These hands are getting ready to turn 57 in three weeks. And I can eat, I never wear gloves. You know, I, I train and practice like I'm gonna train for the street. Because in the street fight, you can't go, oh wait dude, let me get my helmet and my sparring gear on. No. That son of a bitch wants to kill you and you have to stop him before it's too late. So again, practice your strikes, your punches, your kicks if you can kick. Keep them well, you don't need to be flashy and fancy like these fools on the internet. That shit doesn't work in a crowded bar when you're like this. But this, that does. If I'm body to body and shit starts getting weird, he's done. He's going to the hospital, brother. Anyway, practice those. Until next episode. Oh, I hope you enjoyed the, the challenge Brandon and I had that aired uh, a couple few days ago or so. That was hilarious. Not bad for somebody getting ready to turn 57.